to begin by supporting uh, Senator Garvey in regarding the ASD units. I know that Minister um, Madigan is highly cognizant of where the gaps are and, and working and only last week made the announcement of 25 new units for in primary schools um, and I'm working with the Dublin, uh, the Dublin 12 campaign for an autism specific school and, in, and, and involve autism so I, I'm very much aware that issues presented to the Minister are being dealt with very effectively and efficiently and, and we're, we're working on, because for instance in my own area where you have Dublin 6, Dublin 6W and if you were to include in Dublin 4 you have um, a, a situation where there are 9,000 pupils, school places, uh, but yet only 14 places for, an, for autumn specific places. However, that wasn't, that's just supporting that. Very quickly, uh, Leader, I just want to, to bring to the attention and, and seek call for the House to have some sort of a debate where we start addressing um, the reality uh, of, of our services working from home, including our, at this moment in time, we have public services and private services, people working from home in what are maybe not idealistic, uh, ideal circumstances, not conducive to a normal flow and normal work pattern. And that working from home in an unplanned way in the heights of a pandemic didn't necessarily lend itself to the efficient uh, outworking of the public services. Um, and, and, and indeed in private services, it's not, the, not that I'm, and I really appreciate the very hard work that has gone on. However, there, are a, there is a very real issue going on at the moment. I, I am six weeks trying to get PPS numbers. There are delays in, in a lot of, and that's across all government departments, it's not anyone unique. The word you get is, I'm here in the office on my own, if you do get through to somebody. So I think that we need a debate that addresses the reality that because of the circumstances, everything is slowed down. There is going to be a backlog. There are supports that are going to be needed and we need to have a discussion on how we're going to address that in a post-pandemic and get ready for that now. Uh, leader. Thank you.